Hi, good evening, Mr. Wright here. Hope you're all well. Um, as you can see, it's that time of the night where, of course, you know, if you are a single mum or even a mum in business, you know, you're trying to get things done, of course, and you're replying to emails and you're putting new posts on your blogs and your Twitter and your Facebook page. And, of course, for me, um, I have, from from Monday, sorry, I'm launching www.missfromwright.com where you can actually go onto my website and you can purchase a bra. There are actually six that I've chosen, um, Triumph, Inel, um, Pantcha, Sport Jock, Shock Observer One and a Burley and you can all purchase them directly from Amazon Affiliation which is fantastic. Of course I'm off down to London this weekend um, to meet my fantastic lady from Scandafit.com and we will be hopefully creating the ultimate boob job bra so everything is going to plan and we're all excited. Now you can hear a little bit of a squiggle in the background. And of course, I've been a single mum, um, I'm five years down the line now, and of course, when I started off my fitness programme, my son was uh, five weeks old, and um, he, I was actually 15 and a half stone. Um, but of course, I've worked hard at my fitness um, since obviously my son was born, but it's not something that you can do, and you can do, you know, with ease. You've got to time manage it, you've got to juggle it, and you've got to want to do it. I was 15 stone three pound when I started off training with Alexander, and I just used to put him in his buggy, I'd set the clock, I'd start with the walking, mm. I'd start with the running. But I put a blog, a post on Twitter and on Facebook today with regards to how you can actually train yourself for a 5k. You know, you should be able to hold a conversation. I mean, for example, of course, I'm doing some crazy challenges this year because I've got the time, my son's in school, I work for myself and of course I'm doing my degree. Um, tougher Mother of course is one, I think I've lost the plot. Everybody keeps telling me you're mad but I'm going to do it and it's for Help for Heroes because that's a charity of choice uh, for my family, definitely with having two brothers who are extra marine um, commandos. Help for Heroes is a charity that um, does help families and obviously ex-serving soldiers readjust back into normal life after serving for this country and they definitely deserve um, you know, the reward um, because of course you know Think of Afghanistan, think of Iraq, think of the Falklands, um, think of uh, think of Northern Ireland. You know, all these um, soldiers have played a part in in looking after us and our families. So it's important that we do that we do give back. So of course, I've got a couple of nutters that have decided to jump on the bandwagon as well um, and create a team. I've got Rufus Carter, a very good friend of mine from Chester, and uh, Nikki Gale, who's on the outskirts to to Chester. We've got a big group of, of people that we're building up. And there's another one as well that I want to promote, which is Combat Soldier. Now, that is a 5K to a 10K, and again, that's over in, in Chester as well. And that's more towards September, October time this year coming. So, hey, can't give it a go. You've got six months. So look out for those um, 5K um, runs that are out there. I put lots on my Facebook, plenty on my Twitter. Get yourself a group of friends and obviously get training for it. So there's somebody who'd like to say hello to you all this evening. And um, again, when you're a single mum, you're trying to juggle, you're applying to emails, you're doing tweets, you're speaking to people, you're organising finance and all kinds of things. And I'd like to introduce Alex. This is my little boy and he's five. And you give the camera a wave. Hello. And Alex is drawing a lovely picture for his mummy because, of course, she knows when you're a mummy in business, you have to have a big pile of paper at the end of your desk. So, of course, um, you know, he can colour it in. Alex, come, I'm going to talk to you for a minute, okay? Can you tell um, all of my lovely ladies and gentlemen out there that um, what was it like in your baby juggle when you were little? Um, it was very tiny. You were very tiny, yeah. And what did, did you used to come jogging with mum? Yes, I did. Um, I'm Big Dog because he loves me. Hello. That's right. And then when, mom, when, and then when you got too big for your baby jogger, what did Mummy buy you? Um, a Ferrari. And did you drive your car next to your Mummy when you were out running? Yes, was that running? because Big Dog went. Ah! That's right. Of course, so, you know, I'm not just a myth, I really am a mum, I'm a busy one at that, and, you know, it's something that, you know, when you have got children, it is a struggle to find time to train, you know, yeah. don't think that I am, you know, delusional when I've got, yeah, get yourselves out there, get training. It is something that you've got to try and build into a routine, a bit like brushing your teeth or brushing your hair. You know, my son learned very quickly, but brushing your eyes. that's right, at the age of sort of five weeks old, that, you know, 
exercise was a big part of his mummy's life and I'm afraid you know he had to you know endure me doing an hour a day to obviously you know keep my eating and look after himself with regards to my eating but of course he needs to drop weight so again if you're a mum and you're uh, trying to adjust yourself back to where you were before you had your little one you know I'm available for a chat at any time you can always email me it's hannah.sadowska at yahoo.com always drop me an email I'm, I'm happy to speak all day with regards to obviously getting yourselves out there you know and training um, so from me to you have a lovely evening uh, keep looking out for me on Facebook and Twitter www.missrunriot.com with regards to purchasing your bras um, from my Amazon store from next week and I'd like to introduce a little bit of a groove rider um, Ryan Weeks is going to be jumping on the bandwagon of Mr. Run Riot he's going to be doing a few Mr. Run Riot mashup tunes for when you're out running so again look out for Weeks he's posts on my uh, on my Facebook page on Mr. Run Riot's page and um, you know follow him on Facebook and on Twitter he's got some fantastic mixes I actually ran out with his mixes this morning and I was really really impressed so again believe in the run believe in the road believe in fitness even good fitness role models hey i'm one here that's tweeting emailing fixing and all you can hear is this is my son coloring so if you believe you will achieve have a great evening goodbye bye mm -hmm.